Hello everybody and welcome, I'm Evolution Hayes and welcome to another episode of my FIFA 18 career mode with Crystal Palace, this is episode number 4, we did miss the last one, go check it out. Um, so you're probably thinking why am I 17th with 1 point out of 3 games, considering we drew, considering we drew against Huddersfield and then beat Liverpool for the first game, on the first two games. That's because at the end of the, uh, uh, the reason why the last episode came to a scorching halt during the Swansea game is because everything just crashed. And obviously I didn't save it, so I lost it. So I lost the first three games. So I tried to simulate it again. So I tried, I tried to uh, simulate it all again, try and get it back. But we did lose 2-1 to Huddersfield, then 2-0 to Liverpool. Then we beat Blackpool in the Cup. And then we drew to Swansea, so that's why we have one one point out of three games. But it's not to worry; we'll we'll get back to where we were as we're approaching transfer deadline day. Now we've got we've got no one to sign. Might, I might have a short list of people we could sign in January who could potentially replace um, our dead wood, so to speak. But I'm in the process of scouting them at the moment, so when their scout reports come back, I'll let you know. Hopefully, it'll come back, it'll come back in this episode anyway. Uh, seven hours left, nothing to go for. Six hours. I might actually loan out a couple of couple of youngsters um, like Phillips add them to the loan list um, Aluko Juan Pasica all these low, all these 50 rated players Drentford will loan him too add him to the loan list uh, Kai Kai will keep Kirby can go out on loan as well and I'm tempted to loan out Lopardo and then loan in another striker. That's better than 61 overall. I might just do that. We'll just go and we'll sign as a cheap, cheap striker. Um, we have 47. We'll add him to the loan list and then we'll just. Oh, you staff. Let's see what you staff are about. Three star. Okay, we'll keep looking. That keep coming back throughout this episode for that to try and get the five star. Players. Um, let's just see who's loan listed. In the prem, Tony Martinez is a striker. Well, he's probably not as good as Lapardo, though. we found our striker <laughs> we're just well why am I scouting him for no point in scouting him is there and scouting so just go for him um let's see where else where else would we go let's try France any strikers for France nope Germany Ah, oh, a 32 year old. Oh, it'll be dirt cheap. Italy, no. Just goalkeepers. Scotland, Scotland, nope. What about Spain? Oh, I think no one's transfers in there. Yeah, transfers in Spain. Uh, we'll try MLS. Okay. It's 
So we found three strikers. Oh yeah, from Martinez upwards are the players I'm currently scouting to be potential. They're all the wonder kids that could potentially replace our Deadwood. So wait for their scout reports to come back. Um, he has 1.5 million pound release clause. Uh. He has a six. He has a. 670,000 pound release clause and he doesn't have a release clause between 190 and 470 290 and 410 790 and 990 mm. I don't think we'll go for him we'll just remove him because he'll be too old um, so we'll go for we'll go for Porter first if we, if we can't get him we'll go for Brook Madsen so we'll go uh, try and buy him. So it's between uh, 190 and 490, I think it was. Should we just. Um, I think we just offer his value, give him a valuation offer. Actually, no, let's go 190, like it said. Oh, boom, there's me going for a valuation offer. And then we've got him for like half that. Let's just double his wage. Boom, happy with that? Easy stuff. So he's signed for us, so we got our backup striker. Let's see um, how good he is. He is 62, okay, so he's one better than Lopardo, but have a look at his stats. 59. Uh, okay, I think we just waste. Uh, okay, we've wasted some money there, but hey ho, we got a backup, a backup backup striker. And if he doesn't work, we can just always sell him, like next year. And I was saying this, we probably won't, probably won't um, loan out anyone now. Three hours left. Spent sixteen point one million pound. Oh, Joe will go away. We're not selling anyone. <gasps> no, oh, this stupid controller. Oh, for Christ's sake, stupid controller. Uh, I hope war don't go now. Oh, uh, we've got two hours left. Gee, <sighs> try and see if anyone can play right back. Oh, uh. We've got Funtsu Mets can play right, we've got Kelly that can play right back. It's not really a problem, but I don't want to sell Ward anyway. Stupid controller.
Trent will replace Ward with Alexander Arnold. Instead, that is annoying. Right. Might we just offer just a couple of million? We go two and a half. See what they say. Boom. Klopp agrees. So all we've got to do is negotiate a price. So we'll go one more hour. Hopefully Ward just rejects it. Huh? Okay, well it doesn't look like war's being sold, but I'll, I'll, I'll negotiate a contract with him anyway. To be honest, I was going to sign him next season anyway, so might as well just sign him now. Okay, so war didn't even go in the end. <laughs> but oh well. Doesn't matter. So Forest Green wanna yeah, we'll send him to Forest Green, that's fine. So Leicester offered for Benteke and Bayern Munich offered to Zaha, so we're just going to reject both of them. Reject. Reject. Done. Okay, so yeah, Ward did go. Ward is sold, you see that pop up there. So, a good thing we did actually buy Arnold then. Uh, at Turf Moor, 
for our away game against Burnley. Hopefully we can turn it around. Also I've changed that so you can see who's playing, so, so who's who. So it'll be easier to pick out who's cleared what for you guys. Good play between Badeke and Zaha. Zaha got us inside. Zaha, yes! Look at that! Get in! 11 minutes in. Good play between Badeke and Zaha. Zaha cuts inside and powers it into the bottom corner. Look at that. Straight in the corner. Oh, good play between Wilson and Zaha. Zaha cuts inside again. Shoots. Oh, Tom Heaton managed to save that one. I'll hit the town's end. Crossed in. Callum Wilson. Oh, away by Ben Mee. Sacco with the header. Oh, cleared by Ward off the line. Here's Luca. Through to Sacco. Straight to town's end. Townsend runs in, Townsend with the shot, blocked by Ben Mean, away by Jack Cork. Oh, straight to Luca, lays it off for Kabai. Kabai's going to shoot, ah, oh, blocked by Cork, back to Kabai. Back here to Ward. Here's Luca. Luca with the shot, blocked by Brady, and away by Burnley. Oh, well, well, well done, Benteke! Oh, Tom Heaton with the save again, it just went over. Unlucky there. And Sacco! Oh. Boom, half time, 1 0, good play so far, played very well. Holding up the ball with hopefully more from the second half. Saha finds goodbye. Back to Luca. Straight down there's a Townsend. Townsend turns. Townsend beats his man. Townsend with the cross. Better is the Zaha. Oh, way back to Van Arnholt. Runs down the left wing. Gets the cross in. Zaha's there. Zaha with the header. Oh, just wide. Just wide from Will for his second. Unlucky there. Here's Kabai. Back to Bendeke. Bendeke gets the rebound. 2 0. Good play between Wilson. Finds Kabai. Kabai with the shot. Saved by Heaton. And Bendeke with the rebound. 2 0. Oh, Wilson finds Benteke for 3-0. 3-0. Benteke with two goals. What vision from Callum Wilson. 
gets past it, past three defenders. And boom, good finish by Benteke. Damn it. Bad throw. A bad throw there. 3 1. That's alright. This is a consolation goal, really, isn't it? Zaha, free ball to Callum Wilson. Wilson with the shot, saved by Heaton. Can they get a corner? Yes, we've got a corner. Dan, oh, off the post, off the post. Oh, come off. God damn it, the sweaty goal. Goal for Burnley! Number 37, oh. Scott Arfield. Oh, I thought that was in. I really thought that was in. There's two fouls, but just get the keep the three points. Yes, three points. A win against Burnley. Good solid win. Good performance from everyone. Whoops. Right, this is, this is going to be the end of today's episode. If you have enjoyed, please leave a like. Any suggestions, join in the comments. The next episode will be the next three games, so Southampton... Actually, no, it'll be the next four games, because I'll simulate the Bournemouth one. So it'll be Southampton, Bournemouth, and then City and United in one episode. So stay tuned for that one. So yeah, thanks for any support you share on the on this on the on this video. I've been Evolution Hayes. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. I'm out.